He is the worshiper of death, born on the moon of Saturn called Titan, and is an eternal deviant hybrid. He is Thanos. Markman and welcome to the Markverse! Today we are going to unbox and review Hasbro's Marvel Legends series figure Thanos with its Infinity Gauntlet. So as you can see, this is the front of the box. Then let's look at the back where you can see Thanos wearing the Infinity Gauntlet while sitting on his throne and at his back is Death. Then the left side of the box, the right and the top where you can see the six infinity stones. Now let us unbox. This is the figure at makikita nyo napakaganda ng design including yung colors and the creator of the figure became faithful sa comic design ni Thanos. Then the back. Then, yung two sides of the figure back to back. These are things that comes with the figure. First is backdrop which is a carton or made of paper especially for toy photography. Nakikita nyo dito yung throne which is of Thanos kasi he is called King Thanos. And speaking of King Thanos, ito yung isa sa alternate body part na merong crown. This version is old Thanos or simply future Thanos at mamaya ipagpalit, ipagpapalit natin yung isang head sa head na ito. Then yung isang alternate hand niya which is doing the snapping of the finger and you can also see the infinity gauntlet. At nagalaw na rin natin yung hinge niya. Then, another alternate hand, yung claw style na nakasuot din yung Infinity Gauntlet. And then, let's try the hinge. Again, ito yung mga kasamang accessories or body parts ng figure. Now, let's change the body parts. Let's start with the head. Rinig na rinig yung pag-stop ng socket. Sabi ko kanina, this is Old Thanos or Future Thanos, which is also King Thanos. And this is the reason why he has a crown. Maganda talaga yung sculpt ng face, pati yung kakaiba niyang beard na nakatali pa. And let's put the heads side by side for a comparison. Pares napakaganda ng sculpting ng face. Then let's change the left hand. Siguro unahin muna natin yung very famous snapping of fingers ni Thanos. Post natin. Pero parang ayaw ko yung post niya. Para siyang sumasayaw sa disco. But, uh -huh. 
But anyway, marami pa namang way para ma-post siya ng mas maganda. Lagay naman natin yung claw type hand niya. Again, this is the comic version of Thanos. At hindi ito yung Infinity War and Endgame movie. Punta na tayo sa design ng figure. Ilang beses ko na sinabi, the head sculpting is great at very clean din yung paggawa ng helmet. Yung evil smile din ni Thanos yung nakaka-attract sa figure nito. Then itong part nito, it's not just an ornament but also an armor that could protect the upper chest, delts, and its neck. Then the lower and side torso, the abs and the oblique, maganda siya. Then sa arms, bicep, and yung gloves. Yung bicep, iba yung shading ng blue. Then the shoulder. Then this is the other side. This is the other glove. Then let's go to the back. Kakaiba yung design ng tricep niya, including yung shading ng blue. Siguro just to emphasize that part. Then yung costume niya sa waist, maganda kasi kaya itong pagalawin. So yan, nakikita nyo, nagagalaw siya. Tapos yung design ng boots. So, maganda yung design niya. Though, medyo nalalakihan ako sa boots niya na medyo questionable yung symmetry with the height of the figure. Let's proceed to the articulation sa head. We can turn it in full circle. We can also move it down, up, and up and down. Then sa arms, let's move it sideways. Let's try to move the shoulder. So we can move the shoulder 360 degrees. And I think there's also a bicep swivel. Yeah, meron tayong bicep swivel. Then, the elbow can also be turned also in full circle. So, ayusin lang muna natin sa glit. Then, let's go to the wrist. So, same thing with the wrist. So, in full circle din siya. Then, meron ding hinge. yung wrist natin. Getting a better articulation. <clears throat> Balik tayo sa elbow, which meron siyang hinge then but you cannot flex much because hindi siya double jointed. Then sa torso, kitang kita na maganda magiging crunching natin forward and backward. It's because of this part kaya nagiging possible yung Magandang crouching only pag forward and backward kasi sa side crunch naman ay wala. Tapos meron tayong thigh swivel pero yung legs hindi maganda ang range pagkapaside. So hanggang ganyan lang. Sa knee, this is double jointed. So, let us try to move it backward. Yeah. So, hanggang ganyan. Then, the ankle joint. My hinge. So, we can move it up and down. But, we cannot move it side to side and... Yeah, so we cannot move it side to side. And there's also no toe articulation. So that's Thanos figure and design and its articulation. Let's measure Thanos. He is 7.4 inches. Then for a comparison, Let's put McFarlane's All for One of My Hero Academia. 
then that's also use other uh, Marvel figures like Spider-Man, which I had for more than two decades now, I think. Then one of the Sinister Six, si Electro. Mga six inches figure, I think, si Electro and Spider-Man. Then let's change Spider-Man and let's put Hulk. Um, si Hulk of Toy Biz is six and a half inch figure. Let's remove both to have more space sa nine and a half diamond select Hulk figure ko. Okay, so that's a comparison of Thanos and Hulk. Adjust natin ang camera para mas kitang kita. So, that's it. So, that's the measurement and comparison. My thoughts on the figure. First, when it comes to the accessories, I'm happy with the alternate old Thanos head, including the two hands that have the Infinity Gauntlet. And also the additional backdrop throne. Then sa design, the sculpt, yung aesthetic aspect, it's great. Napakaganda ng figure. However, the downside, yung articulation. I am not satisfied with it, particularly sa waist and sa range of movement ng legs niya, especially yung pasay. Magkaka-issue kasi yung possibility nito. But overall, I'm happy with Hasbro's Thanos Marvel Legends figure. So if you enjoyed the video, click the thumbs up button. Please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to push that notification button since I publish new videos every week. Again, I am the Markman. Thank you for visiting the Markverse. And always remember to pay it forward with kindness.